Hey, what's up guys? JS Cards here coming at you with a video talking about Pot of Disparity, which is a new card that's going to be in Blazing Vortex. That's right, we have another pot card, and this card is really good, and I thought it's definitely worth making a video on. So, this card reads as, banish three or six cards from your extra deck face down. Excavate cards from the top of your deck equal to the number banished. Add one of them to your hand. Also place the rest on the bottom of your deck in any order. For the rest of this turn, after this card resolves, any damage your opponent takes is halved. You cannot draw any cards by card effects the turn you activate this card. You can only activate one pot of disparity per turn. So first of all, being able to see the top six cards of your deck is insane because if you are looking for that one piece to make your combo, you could easily search it out with this card. And yes, while banishing six from your extra deck does sound like a lot, a lot of extra decks don't really need every single extra deck monster in there you know they they might only be for certain matchups as for your combo pieces you might only need like five six or seven of your extra deck cards so being able to banish the six extra deck monsters that you won't really need that game is really good considering that you're searching and looking at the top six cards and adding any one of those so that could be you know even if it's not for your combo, it could be a hand trap or something to protect you. So, like the artwork shows, this is a combination of Pot of Extravagance and Pot of Duality. Is being able to draw two like Extravagance better than the Excavating effect? Now, it could really depend on the deck and the situation, but most of the time people are going to say the draw two effect is better. But the nice thing about Disparity is that you could do your drawing and your searching and things like that before you activate this card. So yes, this card does state you cannot draw any cards by card effects the turn you activate this card, but you can activate this after you've already done your drawing and your searching. The longer games go on, the better this card gets as well, because the thinner your deck is, the more likely you're going to see the particular card that you want if you haven't seen it already. I also think most of the time people are going to be banishing six. I can't really think of why you would want to only see three instead of six unless you do have certain extra deck cards that you know you're going to need. I could even see decks taking advantage of just a single copy of this. So maybe two copies alongside a couple copies of Extravagance. Control decks will love this card, but also combo decks can gain advantage from this as well. So yes, we have another $100 secret rare chase card coming in Blazing Vortex, but I have to say I am very excited. I do like the design of this card quite a bit, and this set is looking better and better. Let me know what you guys think of this card down in the comments below. Do you think it's good? Why or why not? And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe for more. We are reaching a thousand subscribers and I'll be doing a giveaway and making some announcements about the channel once we reach that milestone. Thank you guys for all of the support so far. You're amazing. And if you want to join the JS community, check out my socials down below or consider joining my Discord server. Thanks so much for checking out this video and I'll catch you guys in the next one.